Alright, so... Running back to do the first strategy battle of the game. At least that's what I assume is about to happen. Past these lifeless stone villagers. Talk to Lord Barrows, and Boz should join me for this, so hopefully it's pretty easy. I'm assuming it will be probably more of a tutorial than anything. Okay, so um, I will select Inf Try. I will select Inf Try and can't really do anything here. I'm okay. I'm slightly confused, but all right. So I removed Silies from my Gurind unit. Let's. Uh, Oh, okay, hold on, I'm organizing. Gotcha, and then I can end all this and start. I'm, I guess I'll just leave it default. First battle. Battle goal. Destroy all enemies, lose if Frey is killed. We got three inf trees. I got five guys, alright, so this should be pretty hard to lose, probably. Infantry defend against arrows with shields and heavy armor, but have poor mobility and are weak to cavalry. Okay. Infantry unit less mobile with boosts. Boosts added defense and attack. Archers overpower lightly armored cavalry units, but are weak against the low armored infantry. All right, so we got a little little triangle going on here. Little rock paper scissors. Special battle base. Oh, uh, cool. Okay, so special moves. All right. Yeah, okay, so we got the little triangle there. Oh, so is this more like an RTS? Alright, yeah, so this isn't like a straight fire emblem thing, this is... Yeah, this is more like an RTS. Oh, that's cool. And we can attack them. Yeah, let's do that. that one archer unit. <laughs> I mean, I have the archer unit. Normal battle. One guy left, 4 HP. So let's just... yeah. 
strike him. Not dead yet. Let's say, well, let's bring her another week against him. Alright, so let's just kill them. One more battle, 4 HP. Cyclone. Even though it's 10 HP, that's probably stupid. <laughs> but I doubt we can really lose this. Unless you really try. Even if you try, I don't think you can lose it, to be honest. I think everyone is like equal, so. So I'll attack with Frey so I can use this special move. Charge didn't do too much. So Boz is a spear unit, which is different. Sily will no. Hey. Angry Wolf Tactic, nice. Marvelous! Absolutely marvelous, your highness! What a triumphant return! A new god of war is born, the blood of his majesty parent running in his veins! Attention, attention! Listen here, my dear citizens of Rainwall! Helena is about to be undermined by the evil ambitions of the ever so despicable Godwins! But, with the divine guidance of the sun, His Royal Highness the Prince has come to stand before us! And in the name of our Prince, let us join together and fight for the liberty of Helena! We must deal a crushing blow to Godwin, who murdered our queen and the commander of the queen's knights. And we must rescue the captured princess Limslia. We shall restore our beloved homeland to all its former glory. Let our mercy as deep as the fatus, and our authority as powerful as the sun, be revealed to the entire world! Let our mercy as deep as the fatus, and our authority as powerful as the sun, be revealed to the entire world! Let our mercy as deep as the fatus, and our authority as
Yeah, well, that's pretty simple. I assume they'll get a little harder, but... Nice and easy tutorial. That's cool that they're oh, RTSs Highness. now. You've arrived just in time! Indeed, we are in the presence of one dauntless General Dine. He is from Sable, a fine hamlet in the south. Your Royal Highness, I am most honored to meet you. My name is Dine. I hail from Sable. I was ordered by Lord Ralbell to assist you, sir. I came here with some of our troops as quickly as I could. <laughs> You're going to be a big help around here. Sable's close to the border with Armis, so they've always been at each other's throats. But I've heard Armis has been shaking in their boots ever since Dine took command down there. <laughs> No, Lord Wild. I'm afraid your compliments are undeserved. The reason Armis has been docile lately is because their majesties Arshtat and Ferret were so skilled at diplomacy. To show our gratitude to them, we solemnly pledge our strength to help you, sir, in any way we can. Oh, this is most helpful to our cause. What's more, volunteer soldiers have been pouring in from every region. My, my. The day we thwart the Godwin scheme is indeed nigh. Okay, so it looks like the game is about to start in earnest. The game being the recruitment. Yeah, maybe now recruitment will begin a little bit more and start getting new people. Whether they be battle, support, or who knows what else. Mm-hmm. 
Hello, George. Well, my theory is that you did. Got a... Got a Snape and Dumbledore scenario over here. Spoiler alert. Okay, yeah, it does sound like it. Time to recruit. Nice. Nice. That makes me happy, I think. I think the game will speed up a little bit in a good way. Because, <laughs> despite the fact that I've enjoyed it so far, it has undeniably been a slow start. Is this supposed to be a mirror? <laughs> How far we've come in two generations of consoles? Alright, well, it's me and Leon. I guess my theory is mostly correct that Leon is just gonna kinda stick with me for pretty much the whole game. Let's go trade. Uh. And a big harvest of wheat. Great. Okay, let me get like salt. Maybe soybeans. I got vegetables. Nothing. Yeah, I'll stay over 10,000. Sounds good. Alright, now just thinking. Who could I probably rec Oh, no, she looks recruitable, speaking of which. Like, look how much more detailed she is than this guy. This poor sap. Selling his weapon like hotcakes over here. Was this the woman that appeared at... Where was it? The East Palace, I think? Yeah, I guess she's not coming yet. Oh, that's, uh, what's his name? Yeah. Request your assistance. Nice. Man. Come on, nerd. Oh, man. Alright, well... Maybe I won't go right to Rathleet. Seems like somebody's got to be recruited. <sighs> now which way should I go? First of all is... What is this town down here? Oh, I can't even go there, okay. Follow the path. That was nice. That was nice and lengthy until... Ooh! Until a random battle. We got dark bunnies now! Man, look at that swag! I'll just follow the path for now. 
There's something coming up. Oh, yikes. Banshees. Uh -oh. Counter jazz. I actually have to heal. What is that glow? Oh my god. Oh, it's probably a negative status effect. That makes me miss a whole lot. <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah, I'm actually gonna have to heal. That's how you know the game has begun. Estrees. Okay. Let's check it out. Um, I think my weapons are good, yes. Oh, I can go to seven now. Ooh, that's a lot of punch. I'll wait for that. Let's pilfer for treasure? No, uh, nothing. I'll win the war for you, babe. She looks unique. Yeah, maybe not. Ooh, treasure. Hidden. A silence orb. Silence added to attack. Maybe that's a rune? It's blue, so it must be a rune. Sugar, I got veggies. I'll buy. This is a few. Oh, they move west of rainfall? I'm going the wrong way entirely then. Oh. Well, that's awkward.
And that's about it. Okay, well. I guess not too much to currently do in the stream unless I can recruit this dog. Nope. Worth a try. Oh. My rune. Oh, I have a counter. Yeah, you get that. And. Uh, I guess nobody gets that. Okay. <sighs> I forget. Will I ever be able to use the other two? The left arm and the helmet? I sure hope so. So far, it doesn't seem like there's much to do off the beaten path. Whoa. A horror, horror. So I'm just gonna stick on the path. Slightly off to see if something's there. Counter. Aw, oh, man. Dizzy, I guess he's gonna miss. Or he just won't attack. Again. Ah. Well, he did miss. Come on, <laughs> just end it. <laughs> Please. Thank you. Okay. Alright, well since it sounds like I'm going to... I don't even know why. I just said I was going to only go on the beaten path, but no, I just decided to go up this way. Oh, Jesus. Hey, right, better think of something to talk about then. Last time I was going over world maps and games. Classic world maps. Uh, I thought of another one. I said Final Fantasy in general, but... Special shout out to Final Fantasy VI. How the world map changes when you get to the second half of the game. And that game was super ahead of its time. <laughs> Just the fact that it was like the first one of the first open world games that I can really think of. The second half of that game. Pretty much entirely up to you which way you want to go, how many characters you want to recruit, what order you want to do it in. And you can go to the final boss anytime you want. It's really interesting to see how the towns changed after the, uh, whatever you want to call it, the cataclysm, the apocalypse, the, the ruination, whatever. Well, I wasn't paying attention. Can you hit something, please, Ray? I think I actually have to concentrate, sorry. No, oh, maybe not. Siren must be different from... Ugh. Oh, I have no items equipped. Ugh. That's bad, okay. I didn't save. Oh, that's... Oh god, what's wrong with me? It's not like I really did anything, so... Oh, actually, this is a good chance to see if I have to reload. Oh, fantastic! Alright, well, that was worth it just to see what would happen if I died. know that I can redo battles. That's such a blessing. Oh my god. Such a beautiful blessing. 
Alright, so where was I? I was gushing about Final Fantasy VI. Yeah, ahead of its time. Great game. It didn't come out too much earlier than Suikoden 2. Suikoden 1. Highly recommend it. Historically and fun wise. It's a solid game. One of my faves. Yo, is this like a mini boss or something? It's a lot more intense than regular battle. That must uh, dude, that must have been like a rare enemy or something. Cause look at this stuff I got. I got Mad Potch. Mad Dosh. Grants a sword, the protection of water. Ooh. Take me longer to retreat than it would just to kill them. I think I'm gonna end up retreating a lot in the future. Making a lot of posh though. Potch, not posh. And I am curious to see if there's something up here. Something anywhere. Logically, now is not the best time to be exploring, considering only have two characters. Puts me at a pretty major disadvantage, but... It's okay. Oh, it's one of those games, huh? One of those games. I think that's um, whatever that town is called below me. The one that I left from. What was it called? Oh my god. Oh no, 
this is different. Oh god, it's this place. Oh, Jesus. I don't even want to go here. So I remember in here... It was the appraiser, I think? He had like a little backstory. He looks unique. No? He just has a nice hat. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Look at that canvas. Look at that perfection on that canvas. Yeah, this guy. No! Nothing? Come on. <sighs> Alright, well... Maybe there's something. Keep a lookout for interesting looking people. Shouldn't be in any short supply here. Nope, artist. My god, this town is offensive to the senses. Oh. I missed this last time. Oh, I had another tactic, too. I mean, what's really the point of looking at tactics here? <laughs> I have two people. Oh, they actually grant... I didn't even realize they granted different things. Plus four attack, that's cool. Ninja garb, that's crazy expensive though. Um, what was that music? It wasn't part of the the track. It was like a siren. Can't recruit the jiggies. Oh, this girl, I forgot about her. No, she doesn't like me yet. I need better clothes. Town, I guess. Oh, about this one. What the fuck? Battling right now? What the heck? <sighs> Alright, um. Mi fa, mi fa so, fa so la, so la ti, la ti do. No do re mi, well no do re. Oh no, there's do. Do re mi fa, or. Um. Yes. That's what I was looking for. Alright, so they're not too tough. Did I come to this house before? Oh, they're just about all dead, too. Hmm. I'm about dead, too. I gotta go to the inn. Maybe this will lead to, uh... To party members, though. Um, 
I don't know. Sorry. I just murdered his band. <laughs> Stop, bro. My God, this dude just ruined me. <gasps> Join the party. So we're doing like a Pokemon Go thing. Oh, he's in the party though. He wants to... Should I attack? Maybe... I don't know because they're both pretty strong. Okay, let me, let me see what happens. Fig recruits... Yeah. Whoa, what? That's crazy. Might have to be weakened, I guess. Or... Maybe not. <laughs> oh, nice. That looks good. Another party member? <laughs> this is so weird. <laughs> I actually have it in the party, what? <laughs> Re mi fa? Re mi fa, I guess. Wow, it's really bad. Jesus, this is like not even worth it. Okay, well. That must be it for the town then. Yeah, alright. Alright, I gotta heal before anything. I think the inn was up here. Like as far away as possible for me. Rest and save. Don't want to lose my boy. Silides and George to Cornelio and Ray Mafi. Ray Mi Fa. What, what is it? Ray Mi Fa. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I'm gonna peace out. I, I hate this place. This place is a nightmare. It produces nightmare characters. So, uh, back to, 
uh, Rafflet. Ooh, the battle theme changed. Let's level up my boys a little bit. Yikes. <laughs> Wait, Peckles. Uh, is that his name? Always. So he's basically useless. This is what I'm gathering here. As is she. Or he. They. I mean, at least he does some damage. But if he ever gets hit, he's gonna die. This is so goofy. Man. Oh, that's nice though. Okay. There we go. It should be like down here, right? The town I came from. Bang. Oh, he's low. Yo, Cornelio! Sticking this conductor's wand up his butt. Let's do it. Hey, here's a question. What do these squares mean? He just got a ton of them when he leveled up. MP. Ah. Yes, this is... God, what's it called? <sighs> really? Really with the battle? Rain wall, that's what it is. Alright, let me sleep this off. Head on down to Rafflet. Talk to this guy again. Thought maybe Cornelio would uh would awaken her inner desire. Actually, I wonder if I can recruit the fancy lady now that I have Cornelio. He has cool clothes. He's got a cool body. that Rafi? I'm not even gonna try right now. I don't even care. Let's check out the big hole, guys. Ah, yes. The elusive big hole. Cave. 
Maybe I should have saved before coming in the big hole cave. Yeah, probably. Uh, oh, look. It's actually doing some quality damage now. I don't even care though. I love games like this. You just have a ton of characters. And they just like make no sense. <laughs> games to do that though that just have like a ton of recruits I guess that can be today's topic things to talk about games with lots of recruitable characters I mean Suikoden obviously has a lot of recruitable characters it has at least 108 I love like a you know kind of a one note personality most of them probably but Got some good ones in there. Um, hold on, let me. Heal, just concentrate real quick. She still can't do anything, right? Yeah, so you got Sweeten in with a lot of characters. Um, I guess Fire Emblem. It's fairly similar. Got a lot of characters, a lot of uh, one-note personalities. But you become attached to them through battle. So I'll count that, that's another one. Whereas something like Final Fantasy Tactics or... Dysgea... They don't really have personality, you just create classes and stuff. But Fire Emblem has the named characters recruitable. Um, Chrono Cross was another one. Chrono Cross is interesting though. I feel like 90% of the characters in Chrono Cross are useless. We did it. And there weren't as many, there were only... Uh, I want to say 40 something. Ooh, hey what's up player? Round out the party. Surely there's more to this story. Um, 
maybe they, uh, maybe come back later. Maybe I've entered the big hole a little too early. Join us. I see. Yeah, they must be later. Something to show him my prowess with rune magic. Got it. Uh, let's see. What other what other JRPGs have like a ton of characters? It up. Oh, Valkyria Chronicles, that's a good one. Oh, Fred just died, I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> I've never really got into Valkyria Chronicles. I played the first one. And I have number four. I think it is on my Switch. Just never really got into it though. Oh, I forgot the biggest one. Radiata Stories. Yeah. Oh, that one's huge too. That has so many. It's the game with the dedicated kick button. It's genius. Yeah, that game had a ton of guys. That's pretty much exactly what I'm thinking of. It's like the quintessential one, along with Sugaden. Man, I love Radiata Studios. That game like came out of nowhere for me. And it was just so good. That's back when Square was amazing. It was the golden age. I had to go back and play that. Put that on the list of games to play after Suikoden. Not right after though. Just can't do another. 60 hour game back to back it's too much investment you need a triple a palate cleanser not sure what else is coming out though I guess those are all the big games though at least that I can think of Um, oh wait, that's not, that's the revolving bridge. And you can't do it from this side, right? right? Yeah. Alright, well. I shut it was to the west, so I'll just keep going down here. Yeah, I mean, Pokemon doesn't really count. That's, uh... Yeah, you know, they're not developed characters, it's just... JPEG images with stats. Same thing with Persona. Dragon Quest VIII, I think, had the monster hunting. Or a lot of the Shin Megami Tenseis in general. Not just Persona. Yeah, I think the big ones are Suikoden, all the Suikodens, all the Fire Emblems, Chrono Cross, and Radiata Stories. Can't say that was very elegant. There's probably something I'm forgetting there. 
Alright, I hope this down here. Yes, roughly good. I gotta like heal. Trading post. So nothing. Oh, soybeans. Rumors. Big harvest of wheat. Fantastic. Oh, hey, this guy's named. I ran into him before, didn't I? Come on, man. Join me. I don't know what that means. Alright. Let's save. Let's pause a little bit. Come back into it.